Hello guys and welcome to my channel. Um, today I'm out doing some underwater filming. So hopefully I'll get some good stuff for you. Hit me. I absolutely hate it when people walk past when I'm trying to talk to the camera I look like I eat too uh, Right. So I'm out there doing some live baiting. Um, please don't get upset. It is legal here in the UK and it's legal on the waters that I fish, so I'm not breaking any rules, so please don't get too upset by it. If you do get upset by live baiting, then just don't watch. I've just had a woman give me the best response to live baiting I think I've ever had. She uh, come down and I just caught a pike, so spoiler alert. And uh, I saw it up to the camera and she was like, oh, how big is that? What that kind of fish is that? I said, it's a pike. She went, oh, what are you going to do with it? So I'm going to put it back. Some people don't like them though. And she said, Oh, I know, they don't like it because they eat the little fish, don't they? I said, yeah. I said, this is my bait. <laughs> she just laughed her head off and walked off laughing. That's the response I want. <laughs> Absolutely brilliant. You meet some nice characters when you're out fishing. But anyway, as you can see, it's one of the live baits. It's very, very tiny. I'm after pike, so this one might end up just going back. Unless I see a perch and then I can put on a, I know, a lighter rig and try and get the perch on that or something. But I am specifically targeting pike. Um, I actually got a bit of footage using dead baits probably a few weeks ago when I very first got the new underwater camera that I'm using. Um, if I can find that footage out of the hundreds of files I've got on my computer, I name them stupid things that I just can't remember, so hopefully I can find it. But if I do, then that footage will be going in straight after I finish speaking, and that's just a bit of footage of a party rack into some dead bait on the bottom and uh, investigating it, things like that. Whenever there's a camera in front of them, I find that dead baiting, you struggle because you see the camera and they get really wary. Whereas when you're using a live bait, obviously it's a split second decision the pike's got to make. It may be a bit scared of the, the camera or whatever being down there. But obviously if this is a, a prey fish that's about to get away, it needs to make that decision fast to take it. And nine times out of 10 they do and they avoid the camera. They're just not bothered by it at all when there's a live bait in front of it. That tends to be why a lot of my underwaters are is using live baits they just have a lot more confidence when they're hitting them that's all not that it's any better than using deads i tend to find i catch bigger fish on dead baits actually in my personal fishing um, but for underwater purposes live baits definitely work a little bit better now the water clarity is horrible so i hope the footage turns out well we've had a really really hard cold spell everything was frosty and then yesterday and today we had a little bit of rain in the night and it's brought the temperature up that bit more and um, all the muddy, crappy, horrible ice and things that are on the side of the road has been washed down into the rivers and the rivers become a really tinted, horrible, mucky colour. So what a great day to come and decide to do some underwater filming, eh? So without further ado, I'm going to cut to the video. Hope you guys enjoy it. The camera I'm using will be linked in the description. So you guys can check that out if you want to and hope you enjoy.
careful here. The two trebles are right on this side of the mouth where my fingers are in the uh, under the gill plate. To feel one of the hooks against my finger. There we are, beautiful capture. Really, really nice, clean fish. Chock chunky, probably a, a healthy male. Getting ready for the winter spawn. Putting on a bit of weight. Absolutely nailed that bait. You know, these slow, lethargic winter pike. Absolutely nailed it. Hit it hard, that one did.